Well, if a lot of you are like I am, there's certain bites, there's certain times of the year, we just totally miss it. Well, this time, Kevin Powers and I, we timed it right. We're on South Holston Lake, right outside of Bristol, Tennessee, and man, those fish are postponed, they're hungry, and it's easy. All you need is a little pack of Berkeley Power Worms, four inches, throw them in there and hold on. They swim off with it. It's awesome, it's fun, and man, it's really enjoyable. We've got Big D Coach running the camera. It's gonna be a blast. Sit back and enjoy this episode of 3B Outdoors. I'm Nathan White. Thanks for tagging along. <laughs> This one out here might have a little more pull. What a beast of a smallmouth. Look at that. You don't get no better than this, guys. Yes. Yes. We're here in Ohio. Yes. It all happened so fast. Boom. That just happened. You won't catch anything like this out on the water. 3B Outdoors is brought to you by Visit Kingsport, Tennessee. Here we are at South Post Lake. That little point I come around. Go back in that hall, we're back there. Dig us up that floor. Alright, here we go. First of May, second of May, I believe. Fish, the weather's finally warmed up a little bit here on, in East Tennessee. We've had three days of 70 degree temperature. It's supposed to be up near 80 today. The fish up here at South Holston are finally starting to move it up on the banks a little bit. A lot of duck bass. Not a lot of great big ones, but it should be a lot of fun today. First stop of the day here now. We've got a full moon. Fish are starting to spawn a little bit. Like Kevin said, a lot of buck bass. I'm thinking big, that's what I'm thinking. You know what I'll say? Fish this point, Kevin, or you're gonna go on past him. We can start at that point right there. All right. Lee's on a plane worm. Yeah. But uh, there's one. There's one. He had that thing off with him. Oh. Oh, oh God. <laughs> Look what you did. You caught me lose that fish. <laughs> oh, I got him on. I had one of those the other day. Look here, Dust. He's hooked up. Oh, come oh on. it come on. <laughs> I said, watch him a stupid knot, and he come on. There he is. He's got he's it. He's got it? I got him that time. <laughs> All right. Oh, look at that. Oh, my gosh. Fish three. <laughs> Fish three. Kevin, Nathan, zero. Let's try it one more time. God. Here's one. There's one nothing. Oh, there's your line. Yeah, hurry, catch my line. <laughs> hurry, catch my line. That's right. Hurry, catch my line. He broke that net knot I had. <clears throat> Come on, stay on. Are you hooked up? I'm hooked up. Hurt him so we get him in the boat. He's <laughs> big one. He's a, just good keepers, all he is, and big buck bass. I heard him splash. Oh, that's the closest one we've had to the boat today. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, baby. We are now officially on the We're board. We're on the board. That boy can. Uh, I guess he's a keeper. He don't much more if he is. Oh, you're on a roll now. You oh, got it figured out now. Two for two. Two for two. Oh, he's just a little one. It's all right. Fun fishing today, boys. Fun. Thank you, Mr. Fish. There he goes. There he is, Dustin. That's mine. <laughs> that is my fish. That's your fish? I located him. Yes, you did. See if he's got a hook in his mouth where I broke the line there a while ago. Nathan just missed that fish. Now this, he's fixing his worm and kind of snuck in there on him. Cheating. Cheating. Little male bass. That's three. Oh my god! There he is. Oh, thank you. The goodness. big one too. 
Oh, look right here. Oh, it's a better oh, one too. we have struck. He's actually hooked up. I don't know if he'll stay on or not, but finally. Has it been a long day? <laughs> <laughs> it's been one of them days for the books to what not to do. That's a better one. Yeah, that's a little better one there. That may be big fish of the day so far. I ain't no doubt. That is probably the big fish of the day right now. You're right. Right on top of the jaw. Yeah. That's Finally, man. Yeah, a little small mouth and that little worm is the only one shaking it. He swim off. You been caught before? Nope. Oh, he's fresh. This portion of 3B Outdoors is brought to you by these fine companies. Here in Northeast Tennessee, the mountains have a story to tell. An exciting account of outdoor adventure, full of fishermen's tales from our finest rivers and lakes. A genuine page turner, brimming with places to retreat, play, relax, sure to leave you wanting more. Come and write your own chapter in this mountain tale. I've got a food plot to put in, I've got trees to take down, and this is the perfect machine to do it. You can't have it, you had it last week. And besides that, I'm building me a private boat ramp down the river where I can get to my secret fishing spot. And guys, guys, y'all need to settle down. Quit fighting over it, I got plenty of equipment. Hi, I'm Chris Dedrick with Mill Creek Construction. Proud sponsor for 3B Outdoors. Freddie, what I'd like to do, shoot this apple off your head. Chris, no doubt you can hit it, but it ain't gonna happen. Have you been injured due to someone else's negligence? Do you know your time to file a claim is limited by law? For a free injury case evaluation, call 423-896-1974. Jim Williams and Associates, Attorneys at Law. Whether you're spending the day running around at 70 miles an hour in a high-powered bass boat, fishing a competitive stress field tournament, or just enjoying a day on the lake, you can never have enough, Dr. Enough. Check us out on the internet at 3boutdoors.com, plus YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. We fooled with this fish for how long? No, 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 you fooled with this fish for how <laughs> <laughs> You wouldn't take off with it. He'd eat it and peck around on it, knock around. Finally, we stuck him. Bye. Easy boy, easy. Mark that tree, lean, red eyes. Love it, love it, love it. That's not what he said a while ago, was it, Dustin? <laughs> <laughs> He's got it. I don't know, but keep doing it. I like it. He's, he's, I paralyzed him. Look at that. He don't want to. Oh. How can you not like this? I don't know why. Look at that. Look at that. Pliers are missing. Yeah, they're good. Easy. I, I touched him. You better piece of Come here, come here. Open your mouth, open your mouth. Oh, I got him pinned. Oh, <laughs> hey, man. You're tater on that I'm one. I'm telling. <laughs> there you go. Tater, yeah. baby. Now, now we're talking. That's the one that hit twice. It's on thump, thump. That's a female there now. Look at her belly. Baby, what a 
piglet right there. We've been looking for her all day long. Mm -mm, what a fish. Look at that. Oh, with the big one. This is a bigger one. No, that's a good one. I don't know. Is he a foul hook to the line wrapped around him on the tape? No, I got his mouth. He's cool. He just had it wrapped around him a little bit. He's cool. He's cool. Niggins are starting to bite. There another, you go. Another pretty one. Fat one right there, man. That hook just fall out. No, I pulled it. Oh, did you? Okay, okay. Nice one right there, boys. Look right there. Nice. Let's see what's Ah, yes, okay. sir. <laughs> Broke him that time. Golly, man. I can't believe that. <laughs> Gosh. Gosh. This ain't going nowhere. We ain't gonna bite again. I don't know. Did you get it? Yeah, he's a good one too. I thought he was a good one. Oh, this is a good one. Foul boy. Oh, no, that's got, I think I. What is it? Oh, I got a foul hook up underneath his belly. <laughs> Hope he's got my hook in his mouth. Okay, let's get him in here. <laughs> See if he's got my hook in his mouth. Oh my god, I thought we had a monster. That's a different one. Nope, that ain't, that ain't him, I believe. No, I know, man. He's got a hook in his mouth. <laughs> <laughs> what you got, Nathan? I got another decent one, boys. Another decent one. Wither man. He just snuck up behind and grabbed it. Well, he's a good leader with that fish. No, it's a good one. I'll get a hold of him. It's a good one. That a boy. You good one? Damn. They're all good, aren't they? Mean boys, look at him. Watch him jump. He's feeling good today. That's fine, isn't it? Oh. Oh, yes. Oh, we get off the yeah. Oh, yeah. Let's see what we got here. He's down there deep. Pretty little fish. I'll give him a hook and sinker hook. Hook him. When you see those little bitty red flowers on the banks, it's when the smallmouth come to the banks and they start hitting this little worm. Apparently it's true. Oh yeah, baby. Hey, way out here. Oh God. Oh, oh my God. Oh yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. No, we can't net them. It's illegal. That's a big one. That's the one we've been looking for, Kev. <laughs> no, 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 no. The stud? Pretty good. Oh, it's a big, it's a good one. <laughs> oh, happy on this one. Oh, it's a stud. Don't let your get off like I did mine. I don't know if I've got any options or not. I'm going to pull him up and lead him. He's going to have to mine. Open him up, open him up. Oh. Oh, I got him pinned. Oh, he got off. This portion of 3B Outdoors is brought to you by these fine companies. In Northeast Tennessee, you live the mountains, live the music, Live the sizzle of local flavor. Live the heart of its people. Live the adventure at every turn. While you retreat, play, relax. When you visit Kingsport, you live Kingsport. At Mercury, we invested more than 844,419 hours of engineering manpower. 
so you can enjoy hours and hours of untapped horsepower. So buckle up and hold on tight. Introducing the all-new V6 Mercury Pro XS. Light, quick, efficient. Mercury, go boldly. 3B Outdoors is stoked to announce a new partnership with Dwayne Wilson, owner of Dixie Custom Rods and Tackle. He builds truly custom rods at an affordable price for any style and action up to the 9 foot 9 inch ledge rocket. For an amazing combination, add one of his new reels to a custom rod. Dwayne's tungsten jigs and weights, the Mega Flash and Dixie Triple Threat umbrella style rigs are proven fish catching machines. Dwayne might even build you one just like the one I use, a 7 foot 4 inch medium action tight lining rod that is totally out of this world. Luminox are brighter, more durable, and with replaceable batteries, the longest lasting compound and crossbow lighted knocks on the market, period. When your moment of truth comes, rely on the only lighted knock trusted by the best. Luminox. Light them up at Luminox.com. Oh, he got off. Look at him, look at him. <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> look oh. at that, son. Man, oh man. That'd make an undertaker smile, wouldn't it? We love it, man. We love it. Look how pretty them things are marked up. Mmm, mm mmm. -mm. There you go, baby. This is what makes you want to come back. Little green worm. Light line, tuggers, man. I'm talking about tuggers. Another big one? Oh, no. Oh, it's, it's a good, good one. Oh, it's a good one. It ain't nothing like yours, but he's a good one. Oh, that's a good one. You need help, he's gonna get No. Good. Oh, nah. man, he's a, he's a acrobatic. He's putting on a show, and... Oh, that's a fat daddy. That's a little fat one, but... Oh, thank you, buddy. Atta boy, Kev. Nice one. These plain old stowaways. This is for hooks and sinkers. It's specifically designed for that. It's got four latches on it. Keeps those good heavy sinkers and jig heads and stuff in there. Keeps them organized well. Good deal right there. Oh, yeah. That's a good one. You are the man. Oh, yeah. That's a nice one. That's a good one. Right on. Thank you, buddy. He's right where you call him. Yeah. You said we're going to go through the kitchen. Oh, thank you, Mr. Fish. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. It's a pretty one. They're all pretty. Got a lot of bucks, though. I think females are getting ready to come up, ain't they? That one is. That's pretty. You're the man. Here. Uh, what do we call it? 20? Oh, oh, yeah. How I many should we call it? 30? More than 30? Problem. Oh, yeah, baby. That's a big one. That's a big one. Oh, yeah, he's a good man. Yeah. Well, he just oh, gave up. Yeah. He just quit him. He said, that's Kevin Powers. There's no use fighting him. Got it. That's a pretty fish. Look at that. Look how solid he is. That's probably a female. A little belly and a little puppy, a little bunch of... Thank you, Mr. Fish. I thought he was bigger than that when he first jumped. Me too. What you got? Got one, baby. Good looking. Oh, good. it's one of them mean ones. Cameraman rocks, baby. Hey, you gotta say it. Cameraman rocks. We good out. Just like yesterday. I was killing turkeys. Today, catching smallmouth, baby. Let me say your leader. I know. Must pull be down there pretty deep. Yeah, pull it, come down in there. See your leader now. Still feeling it all? No. 
We're not. I'm trying. There he is. Did you get him? I think I'm hung up. <laughs> you got that knot tied yet? Got him. <laughs> He's a big one, okay. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh buddy, I love you. You was hard to catch. <laughs> Hooked up again here. Another fat one. Oh. Where's the hook at? He about got it. He about got it. Yeah, boy. Another buck. God, they're pretty. Oh, I'm sorry, Mr. Fish. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Thank you, buddy. Another good one. Make a monster. He's a dancer. Finally. I had a dry spell there. A dry spell. Look at him. Mm. Yeah, give me the bad spot and you take the good spot there. I see how you are. Chunk. A little male. A little male got a hump back on Look at him. Does, don't he? He could play for Notre Dame. A little hump back. Finally! Been a while. I had one take me down there around the tree a minute ago, and I don't know. Lost my old momentum. This portion of 3B Outdoors is brought to you by these fine companies. Have you been charged with a crime? Do you know your constitutional rights? For a free criminal defense consultation with an experienced Tennessee, Virginia criminal defense attorney, call 423-217-4685. Jim Williams and Associates, Attorneys at Law. Well, this turkey hunting is way overrated. Let's go down to Kearney's and get us some of that roasted chicken. You know what Mike says, seven days about chicken makes one week. Let's go. On a good home cooked meal, come to Lynn Garden Restaurant in Kingsport. You won't be disappointed. And here's the proof. I've got a food plot to put in, I've got trees to take down, and this is the perfect machine to do it. You can't have it, you had it last week. And besides that, I'm building me a private boat ramp down on the river where I can get to my secret fishing spot. And guys, guys, y'all need to settle down. Quit fighting over it, I got plenty of equipment. Hi, I'm Chris Dedrick with Mill Creek Construction. Proud sponsor for 3B Outdoors. Freddie, what I like to do, shoot this apple off your head. Chris, no doubt you can hit it, but it ain't gonna happen. Here in Northeast Tennessee, the mountains have a story to tell. An exciting account of outdoor adventure, full of fishermen's tales from our finest rivers and lakes. A genuine page turner, brimming with places to retreat, play, relax, sure to leave you wanting more. Come and write your own chapter in this mountain tale. Check us out on the internet at 3boutdoors.com, plus YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Well, the batteries on the camera died naturally. What you do, you pull in here and bang a big one. So we're going to capture it the best way we can. If it turns out on the iPhone, it'll be good. If not, we got a picture. You'll at least get to see it on 3B Outdoors, baby. <sighs> the little worm, what a day. Man, you talk mama. Talk mama. This is big mama. Big mama. Big mama. 
This is yours, Kevin. You hung her earlier and she got off and you hooked her again a second ago. Just pour salt in the wind. Look up. at that. Look her go. <laughs> you tore out a piece of Man, oh man. Going no horse, not my worm. Man, what a beast! Great day, great day. I'll give you tighter anyway. I just topped it off right there. <laughs> topped it off, <laughs> guys. It's been a great day here on South Holson. Probably caught 25, close to 30 fish. Um, probably had that many more bites. To tell you the truth. I had a tough time getting started. You gave a clinic early. I had seven or eight bites for her, put one in the boat, breaking them off, doing stupid stuff. And just put That's it just the nature of the game. I mean, it's going to happen um, until you get dialed in what you got exactly, how you got a jerk and everything up here. Um, every fish we caught today has been on a little worm. A little Berkeley power worm. Uh, power crawler. Power, 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 green power pumpkin. Crawler. Green pumpkin is the only color you need, guys. Um, One eight pound sinker. Eight pound sinker. We're throwing some eight pound fluorocarbon, some braided line, a little bit, and everything. Uh, even caught some on on mono today. Throw whatever you like at the guys. But come fishing at South Holston. When the water temperature gets above 60, about 62 to 65 degrees, we're going to head to the banks and you'll catch them like we did today. Full moon. Caught as many during the middle of the day as we did in the night. Shady banks, uh, bright sunny banks, as you can see in the background right here. Uh, it's not that hard. If you can't catch one up here this time of year, Sell everything you got, take up golf. Spinning rod, I was using Dixie Custom Rods, seven foot medium action. I uh, had 12 pound floor, I mean 12 pound braid with a eight pound floor carbon leader. Kevin throwing a St. Croix rod, uh, eight pound test, so we're good to go. Hope you had fun hanging out with us. Man, this don't happen very often, but when it does, you better be here. I told you it's going to be one of those great days that you just don't want to miss. It was so good that Big D and I actually stayed a few hours after Kevin had to leave and caught a few more. And if you noticed real close, I was having a terrible day to start with. Breaking line, couldn't hook them up. Man, it was just awful. I was getting frustrated, but I stayed in there, stayed tough, and even caught that big fish that Kevin had hooked once, maybe twice. But man, it was awesome. Don't miss next week when Fred and those hunting guys are hanging out of a tree stand, looking out of a blind, or doing something, well, trying to shoot something. You know how those boys are. I'm Nathan Light. Thanks so much for watching 3B Outdoors. We wake up in the morning before the rising sun. Load up boats, rides and reels. Cameraman rock! There you go, baby. Wanna have ourselves some fun. Oh, he, he does have it too. Does he? Yeah, he's got it. <laughs>